This make you feel like do. Why this make you feel like do? Why this make you feel like do? Girl, bend over, come boy into the broke off your back, broke off your back, broke off your broke off your broke off your back, broke off your back, broke off your back, broke off your back. Welcome back to the channel, Making It With The Matthews. If you're new here, it's your boy Travis. And we got something going on. As you can see, we got a bottle of Moet, Rose Imperial, and it's a celebration for just a little bit of everything. You know, God's been coming through a lot in the last few months, in the last few weeks, and especially in the clutch. You all can see a video for that, so that's a little plug. But um, we'll explain more, but just know it's always a reason to celebrate. So I've had this bottle since my birthday last year for my 40th. And I'm finally popping it, so let's do this. <laughs> Ooh, look at that. You all saw that? That's good fortune right there. Wow. <laughs> That's good fortune right there. That's been waiting to open. That's what that means. <laughs> that thing just popped all the way out. Waiting to open. That's my glass, you guys. Alright, you know, since we had the Jamaica vlog, we're all about the pack with me, travel with me content. So, this is what this vlog is going to be. So, today is two days before our trip and um, we have a lot that we need to get done. So, we're going to be taking you guys with us all the way up until we land in Antigua. So, let's get the ball rolling. We got stuff to do. Can you make me go loco? Guys, guess who I'm picking up? My mom. So I'm almost at the airport. Let me turn that off. So I'm almost at the airport to pick her up because she's flying in to watch Taylor so that we can go to Antigua. And um, so I left work early today. Today is my last day at work. And I just can't wait. I just honestly can't wait. So things are moving, you guys. In no time, we'll be headed to the airport. And in no time, we'll be in Antigua. So I'm super excited. Let's go get mommy. Nobody do me like this, oh, oh no no no. Can I be do anything? No, if you go be my lover, yeah. I don't mind, baby, please, yo yo. Angelina, you are me for go. I tell you, my my love. Welcome to Charleston, Hattie Hattie. Hey, let me know the care of the girl. <laughs> Home guys, music already spotted mommy from outside. So I said she had work and I clean. This is room. Mm -hmm. Look at it. Guys, we had laundry. She folded them already. Back mm -hmm. on the road, guys. Yes. Yes. We're downtown. Angelina, you are me for Yeah. How you my mind? Guys, so we're out here at the battery when we have stuff to do. <laughs> But we saw that they're about to do a proposal, and so we fasten on the proposal. This is the people them over here, you guys. We're waiting to see where the girl is. They're about to take it off now. Oh. 
guys. Mommy brought us some tamarind, or tamarind, as you guys would call it. <laughs> oh boy. It's sourdough. This is what tamarind Sour. looks like. We just taste it. It's sour, right? It's sour. Mm -hmm. I will put sugar on it. You want to put some brown sugar? Yeah, Oh baby, make me day together. Gucci Fendi, any designer for your body, ah, uh, for your body. Uh. Mm. Oh my darling, you know get wala. Any day come and chop my rubber. So quick check in. I'm currently at the airport, um, picking up our rental car because. We'll tell you the whole story about why we're actually flying from Orlando again this time. But yeah, we're picking up the car and then gonna get nails done, a few other things, getting Taylor ready for school. I'm braiding her hair at the moment and gotta do some grocery shopping. So there's so much to be done. I get the money up. Got the rental car, guys after they charged an entire $400 deposit just to have a one-way car rental from Charleston Airport to Orlando International. We got this cute little Jeep, you guys. Of course, I'm picking the bright red orange Jeep. What else would I pick? Yes, it is. I'm gonna first connect because I wanna be able to play my tunes. Let's ride out to some dance hall and some reggae. Okay, I'm actually not feeling my best right now. Like, I have no idea what's happening. I just feel sick. And I need that to go. I'm home and if you're wondering why I'm in bed it's because I'm exhausted and I need a 30 minute nap in order to continue doing all of the things but my nails are done I'm home I got it simple so that we could be quick I'll show you Taylor's nails soon <sighs> guys I'm tired vacation planning is never easy it's just too much going on, but my mom being here is allowing me to decompress and just relax really quickly. Hubby is still at work. He's leaving around 3 o'clock. And we were waiting on a Shein order. And we were waiting on a Fabletics order. Fabletics isn't going to make it, but Shein is now out for delivery as of 10 minutes ago. So we think we're going to get our package, which is as super exciting so let's see when the delivery comes also I know I told you guys I was going to tell you about why we're actually driving to Orlando yet again to fly out for vacation so this one time we finally used a travel agent because the wedding that we're going to they had a travel agent and I said you know what I'm too busy let me try using a travel agent so we had our consultation so we thought that at one point that you know we might take Taylor to Orlando to my mom so when we talked to her we said um, Orlando's an airport cho airport choice and so is Charleston but we'd prefer Charleston she then sends us the itinerary which was for Charleston because it was the same price and we decided we might as well just go with home rather than drive six hours five and a half hours to Orlando and have my mom fly up anyways she sends the email, I approve the itinerary, great flights, everything, going through Miami. And I responded and said, great, let's move forward with booking. Anyways, booked, everything's good. I didn't double check when I paid our deposit that it was the correct itinerary. And so this was March when we booked. And in July, when, I, when we made our final payment, I looked at it and said Orlando and I'm like why would it say Orlando but I just thought that maybe I was wrong and we actually did pick Orlando anyways I decided to reach out to her like three weeks before the flight I was like listen 
I found our original email where we booked for Charleston, but when I logged in, I see Orlando. Can you explain what's going on? And so she realized that she made a mistake with booking Orlando and um, she tried to change it to Charleston, but it was just too late in the process and all of the flights that were left were all uh, business class and it would have been too much of a hurdle or too much money. And so hence us driving to Orlando. And usually I would push for them to change it, but when I tell you the pressure and stress of the whole passport situation just basically made me realize like, this is not even worth it. We're going on the trip, we got the passport. Let's not even worry. It's not like we don't have a house in Orlando we can go to to rest before going to the airport. So yeah, that's why we're going through Orlando and not Charleston, hence why we needed a rental car to drive down. So rest is important today. So I'm gonna continue, I'm gonna take a nap and I'm gonna get up, finish braiding Taylor's hair, finish doing all of the things so we can go. Look what just came. We got our box. First thing on top, the biker girl short. Talk about counting down to the wire. What's that? So turn around. Grandma, we've been lied to. Huh? We've been lied to. Mm, this Look is at all these clothes, Grandma. And that's not the end of the box, Grandma. Now that my package came, I could just empty out the old stuff. He said, oh, this is the first time I'm packing video. without any new stuff because I have so yeah. much stuff from Jamaica. That's what she said. Lies. Yeah. She lies. Haters. Oh All right, guys, we have an hour and a half to pack. I'm going to empty out my whole suitcase that I had of clothes prior to getting all the stuff that I want. <laughs> I just threw whatever I saw fit. That's a lot of this. I don't even need any of this stuff. Like this was my backup wedding dress with the back out. All right, guys, I'm just gonna have to start this whole thing over. As you can see, I'll just put the necessary and then I'll put in the oldest stuff. This is gifts for family. So of course, you know, we use these packing tools. Totes. How are you feeling about this rush packing? We've been going to Orlando for the last few times, so honestly, it's not even an issue. This is gorgeous. We have already packed. He was just organizing them. Wait a bit. Yeah. You ready for it? I am ready. Look at my new phone case, guys. A little lopsided, but it's cute. Mommy to the rescue yet again. She's helping Travis pack. All right, mommy gonna weigh the scales. I mean weigh the bags for us. No. She says she thinks this one is 42 pounds. Come on. Stand up on it. See, it says zero. Yeah, no. Okay. Let's see if she's right. Yes, she is on the money. 182 and he said one. Party! <laughs> we got it. So that's 42. Way my now, mom. Might still have to pack it first. No, you can just go on it. Anyway. Come on. 185. Wow. Oh, what oh, is that? wrong with you? 45 pounds. Yes. <laughs> no, man. You do too much packing. Too much yeah. packing and stuff. No, so am I good or am I good? You're great. <laughs> now we well, guys, look where we are. We're almost cleaned up, right. and we need to go in 20 minutes exactly. Mommy is cussing us out. Yes. We are en route to the airport. 
before. It's now 9.30 p.m. But we're so excited. We're so, so excited. So this obviously isn't catching me right now because it's too dark. So we'll catch you all when we get to the airport. All right, see y'all there. Six hours, y'all. Why did they open back up? Anyways, we just dropped off our rental car. It is now 3.40 a.m. Just dropped off the rental car. Heading to check in our bags. We're already pre-checked in, but we need to drop our bags. Terminal. That was a short sign that we could join the people. Pull up a gas station, we're gonna pump our gas. We jump in the elevator, we ain't pushing no button. <laughs> <laughs> the elevator gonna open up. Said I really wanna love you. I just wanna hug you. Said I really wanna love you. Come on. We are officially in Miami. We're trying to find breakfast because we are super hungry. Guys, I just slept like a baby through that flight. So did Travis. Got a little turbulent at the end because we kept feeling like they were turning the plane around and around. Oh my gosh, this is going to be such a long one. Is it pronounced Kuva? Yeah, Kuva, yeah. Kuva. Yeah. So Travis is seeing if he wants to order from the menu. Because again, like we said, we're very hungry. We, we're on our way to a different location, but then I like Cuban food, so I was trying to see. You want to try the other one? I'll have the Cuban omelet. I'm going to have the El Guajiro. Um, over medium. Yep, that's it. Thank you. Alright guys, we're having Cuban food at the airport. Oh my gosh. Remember when we got our first Cubano? Where was that? Nope. The first experience. Montreal. Montreal. Good job. For some reason, I was envisioning where it was and it felt like the streets of Puerto Rico, but it was my girl that I remember. Yeah. And we kept going back for more? But I just remember we changed no. the way we made coffee. Yeah, and then, so the first place we got it, they literally gave you like a kind of you know, to the bottom of the coffee and top of a smaller place. No, was, didn't we try Cabana at our favorite place that we went for brunch, Tommy's? Mm -hmm. No? And they got two Tommy's? Yeah. It is just the core. It's the scene of people in the heart of Cuba dancing, playing the drums. I think that's such a good representation. Not that I've been to Cuba, but. Let me show you why. Let me take you for a ride. Yeah, I think it just might. Doesn't like this. He said there's no sugar. No, it might be on the sugar. Stop you done. I taste it on the done. You're right, babe. <laughs> I taste it on the done. Where's the con leche? I say no one. How do you know coffee with milk? Cafe con leche is coffee with milk. Ain't it not most sweet milk? <laughs> Guys, you I literally just got a cup of coffee this. with milk. Oh no. Let me take you for a ride. Yeah, I think I just
What's up guys? I haven't come back to you guys in a few hours. We're still in Miami. Um, I'm currently editing a video to go up today. It's a video on um, our Travis's whole passport situation and what's happening in the country right now with passport applications and how long they're taking. So if you're watching this video, chances are the passport video is already up so please go and watch that i'll link it here as well but it has really good information on how you can save your trip if you're concerned about saving your trip and get your passport in a day uh, possibly or in a few days so yeah check that video out and um, let me know and comment down below that you actually went to go see that video we hope that it's actually doing well. I can't speak into the future, but I think it's going to be a well-received video, honestly. So many people are going to be able to benefit from that because I did a lot of research and I wanted to make sure that I was doing the right thing to get us on this trip today. And so all praises to the Most High. All praises to Him. I've been looking through the stars above my head for an answer. Now you're right across the way I can't contain. Hold up, baby, where you come from, flying NASA Out of space, she an angel from the pretty flash Let me show you why Let me take you for a ride Yeah, I think it just might About to go through immigration. Let me try, we just go with the motions Close your eyes, ease your mind for a moment Need no smoke that make you feel you floating You know joke or you pressure, you know it You know it, you know it I don't follow the pressure, I'll be handling the business Alright, let's go see where we're supposed to be Traveling with us, we finally made it to Antigua. Glad to give you guys all the ins and outs of traveling. Now that we're there, it's time to turn up. Make sure you watch the next vlog. If you won't be doing it on Antigua, on our first day. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe, like, and share the channel. Let's go. Yeah.